combat viewers, we want to determine which of these two values is larger. Now to do this, we need to simplify this separately. Now for the first one, we have the fifth root of 7. Now simplifying the fifth root of 7, here recall that if you have m root x, this is the same thing as saying x to the power of what? 1 over m. So rewriting this in the same way, we're going to have 7 to the power of 1 over 5. Yeah, the same thing is going to be done to the next one, which is what? Cube root of 3. So here we're going to have what? 3 to the power of what? 1 over 3. Now, in order for us to determine which of these two values is larger, then we can multiply both powers by what? By the product of the denominator, which is going to be 7 1 fifth multiplied by what? 15. Okay, the same thing is going to be done to 3. So the power of 1 third multiplied by what? 15. Now, recall the rule of indices that says that when you have a to the power of m, n, which is the same thing as a to the power of what? m times n. Now, here I'm going to have 7 to the power of 1 fifth times 15. And here you're going to have 3 to the power of 1 third times 15, which is 7 to the power of 3. And here we have what? 3 to the power of 5. So 7 to the power of 3 is going to be 343. And 3 to the power of 5 is going to be 243. We can see that this is greater. So we say that it is greater than. Thank you very much for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe. See you next time.